Well, what a journey Varun Beverages has had, isn't it? 18x from its IPO, positive annual returns every single year since listing. Shareholders who have the stock have made merry, but there is a certain section of the market that has missed this fizzy rally, and that is India's mutual funds. Now, let's take a look at this chart which shows you the holdings of both domestic and foreign investors. Now, Varun Beverages listed in late 2016, and at the time of listing, the FIIs had just over 8% stake, while the domestic funds had just started started off with a 1% stake in the company. Now, domestic mutual funds first raised their stake nearly a year after the stock listed. Sometime in March 2018 is when they had close to 5% stake in the company, now compared to the 1% earlier. By then, the stock had already risen close to 50% in value. From that point, until the next six quarters, the domestic funds continued to raise their stake until it reached a peak of around 6.4% towards the end of June 2019. Now, this March 2018 to June 2019 period also saw the stock rise close to 50% in value. Now, the stock in 2019 had also announced its first bonus issue of shares. However, since then, the domestic investors have continued to gradually pair their stake in the stock and trying to book profits that they have made over time. Now, domestic investors have reduced stake in Varun Beverages for seven quarters in a row now, starting March 2022. And from now, from that 6.4% peak, now they own only 2.2% stake in the stock with no fund holding a stake in excess of 1%. Now, during these seven quarters, the shares of Varun Beverages have tripled in value and have also announced another bonus issue of shares. Now, in contrast, the FII stake has risen from 8% at the time of listing to the current peak of 26.5%. Now, FIIs have also increased their stake in six out of the last seven quarters. Some of the prominent uh, investors that still hold a stake in the company include the Government Pension Fund and the Government of Singapore. So, it's been a journey to remember so far for Varun Beverages, one of the most successful IPO stories over the last decade, but some funds failed to see the fizz.